Today I'm going to review the BOA BB pistol by Bear River. This is a CO2 powered air pistol that shoots .177 caliber steel BBs. You load the 12 gram CO2 cartridge in the grip. The grip slides backwards allowing for the loading of the CO2 cartridge. It has a dropout magazine and the magazine release is, the button is right here. The magazine holds 20 rounds. The BOA shoots BBs at the maximum velocity of 410 FPS. It has a Picatinny rail so that you can mount accessories such as a laser sight. The safety is on the side of the air gun. The trigger is disengaged from an internal mechanism when the safety is on. It has a front fixed sight as well as a fixed rear sight. The front sight has a white dot which makes it easier to see. This air pistol does not have blowback action like a real firearm and the hammer is not real and is molded into the gun. The bower exterior is made of molded plastic. It's amazing how close the Crossman C11 resembles the Bear River BOA, down to the locations of the screw holes, the safety, and the magazine release. It makes me wonder if the BOA is manufactured for Bear River by Crossman. In fact, the BB's gun magazines are interchangeable. It's a good idea to put a dab of Pelgun oil on the tip of the CO2 cartridge. The oil will help lubricate the air gun's internal workings. The grip on the BOA is ergonomic and comfortable with the beaver tail fitting snugly between my thumb and forefinger. The BOA has a fairly heavy trigger pull. You must work hard to steady the air gun when pulling the trigger. The BOA is fairly accurate with all BBs hitting the target within a one inch radius of each other. The BOA is currently for sale on Amazon for $29.99, a full $7.50 less than its counterpart, the Crossman C11. In my opinion, the Bear River BOA would be a great inexpensive CO2 air pistol for someone new or just getting back into the air guns. Experienced blinkers would grow bored with the BOA due to its lack of blowback action, not having a real hammer, no auto mode, and its molded plastic exterior, which does not resemble a real firearm prototype. Thanks for watching. Please like my post and subscribe to my channel.